Hey everybody, so today's video is going to be a video, um, today's video is a first aid help video, um, so yeah, so the video today is how to, um, heal a broken toe, like a toe that's still intact, but it has broken, but it's pretty much about to fall off, um, so yeah, and there's many ways that your ra rabbit can't break its toe, if it's on wire, it can get its foot caught in the wire and break its toe that way and stuff like that. Um, yes, you can probably see her breathing hard because um, she did break her toe. Not her toe, um, her nail. Sorry guys, had it, her nail broke. And I wanted to try to be very gentle because it can be very, very painful for your rabbit. Um, so I'm just going to show you it. So you want to be very, very gentle with them. See if I can. Okay. Oh my there it is. She broke. She was running in her hutch. Ran, ran up into her hutch because the dog scared her and. That somehow broke her toe. I guess she slammed into the side really, really hard. Um, but she should should be okay with these steps. Um, so yeah. So what you're going to need is obviously your rabbit. Some people like to put them put them in a towel because it's easier to control. But um, it's up to you. We're going to need one cotton or a Q-tip. I always have, have a whole bundle here, that's for my first aid kit. Um, some vet, vet wrap, because you should wrap it up for um, at least one day so that they can, it'll have a chance to heal and the rabbit won't be licking it and all that. Um, Steptic powder, I think I believe it's pronounced. Um, it's just you can find it. It's called Blood Stop or Quick Stop. It's okay. Shh. Here, Neosporin. Um, this stuff will heal it fast. And if babies can have it, so can rabbits. Um, we put it on our dog's floor, and they've licked it off. It's perfectly safe, and also you're going to have that, this stuff on it too. Um, scissors to cut your wrap. These are specifically made vet wrap cutters. And then also some tape, I guess, to hold, steal it too. And support its foot that it's on. You don't want any pressure on that quick because it can cause more damage than what it already has. Oh, yeah, and, oh, shit. Sorry about my foul language. Um, you're also going to need some, um, something to clean it. Yes, it's to say alcohol prep. Um, trust me, this will be just fine for them. Um, my mom has done it many times with our dogs to prepare for that. Our vets have used it before. And everything I've seen my vets do it on my other rabbits so trust me it this is just fine it's just to clean it um, so yeah so what you want to do is just support your rabbit put it on its back like this and support it I can show you a better view right here I know. I'm sorry, BB. And her nail is still intact right now, so that's really bad. Um. Oh no, it came off. Good. Okay. So it is painful for her. You at least need to treat it. So find. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is, it's going to hurt probably, um, but it's the best thing for them, and trust me, I know what I'm doing, 
Um, I've had permission from a vet to do this. I will not do anything that would kill her or anything. She wants to get the pad. You can use hand sanitizer, that'll work too, but these things only cost. And they smell like alcohol too. I like to drain some of it out just so it's kind of less for her. Make sure ra rabbit is calm before you do this. And then rub, rub it some. Now put your quick stop off on it. And then blow the rest off. And make sure you um comfort your wrap wrap the entire way because this is probably very painful for them. I understand, honey. your neosporin. Well, actually first you want to take your cotton swab and try to swab any of the pad away because it's been on for at least 30 seconds. And if you actually look, well, I can't show you right now. It's probably, it'll be too much stress on her. Is she actually has some stuck onto her nail, which is extremely good. And play your neosporin. Did it go on there? Okay. Then what you want to do is take your um Yes, I know my dogs are barking. Take this stupid pad thing and put it over its paw. It's like this. Do the most absorbent side and just wrap up its paw. I can actually use a little bit less. It's like this much. Then it's not here, but you have to put tape on it. And then do um if your rabbit is outside, I would recommend keeping him inside so you can supervise it and stuff like that. Um, make sure it's not too tight.
know, honey. And you're going to take some of your tape. And then just, again, make sure it's not too loose or too tight. And put the tape on. Okay, so it's just came off, but that's basically what you want to do. So yeah, guys, bye.